Okay, so we're gonna jump right into this video. I recently just got my haircut. My aunt did it and I think it's super uneven. So I'm gonna let it grow back. But in the meantime, I'm going to get my clip-ins from Curl Queen. This is their kinky coarse yakky clip-ins. I'm gonna leave the name down below. But I'm gonna start off with I flat iron in the hair so it can give me like this nice flat look towards the top um but the hair is already flat iron i love the texture it looks so good it matches my hair perfectly and then i'm just going to part my hair and you know apply the clippings so this is my fourth time wearing these clippings the first time i went to the dominicans just so i could see how they did it if you guys haven't watched that video go ahead and watch it it's like a vlog style video but i decided to do this by myself this is my fourth time applying these clippings they are really really good but i'm going to start off by taking my spray and i'm going to braid the hair yes you're going to have to braid i didn't know this trick until i went to the dominicans um but she was doing it so i'm like okay this is how and it ended up lasting like super super long like at least like three weeks so if you do this your hair is going to last a long time keep in mind that i have very thin hair as you guys can see is genetics if you guys are new here you guys don't know but my family has thin hair well my mom does um and i got it from her and yeah so i'm just going to apply the clip-ins on top of the braid and that helps it becomes more sturdy and nice and look it's just not gonna go anywhere it's kind of like a sewing but not a sewing but kind of like a sewing but no it's clippings it's curls queen clipping and i love it so much so the clippings came in different sizes so the first one i just put was the one with the three clips the next one is going to be the four clips and then the one after that is going to be the five clips and then i'm going to work backwards so i'm going to do the five clips again then the four clips then the three clips then the three clips again and then do two clips i have like smaller pieces to put in the front of my hair Now we're going to do the front of the hair. You could do a side part or you could do a middle part. Side part would have been cute, but since my hair is freshly cut, I think I'm going to go ahead and do a middle part so it can blend better. But I'm going to take it. And this is one of the three clips that I was just mentioning. I'm just going to put that like kind of like a side part just in case if I do want to flip it over and, you know, hide it and do a side part, I can have that option too. So it's good to do it that way instead of just putting like the little pieces in the front only. Get to the middle. Um, I do not braid like the last two tracks. So I just apply it on top of the other one so it could give me that nice flat look. Um, I feel like it still would have been flat regardless because the west of this hair is so amazing but i decided to do it like that instead and now i'm just going to style the hair um flat iron it a little bit this is how it looks um it still it looks a little more kinky than usual so i'm going to just take my flat iron and flat iron the hair After I'm done, I'm going to take my hairspray, my even spray, and I'm just going to spray it so my real hair can blend well with the, um, the hair. <laughs> and I'm going to brush it together and just so it can be like super smooth, super nice. Look how nice that look, y'all. Like, this looks so good. Because I have thin hair, I do use black edge control to do my edges. I find it to make my edges look a little bit more fuller. Um, so I'm just going to do that. If you need more details on how I get that done, you can keep on watching. Or you can watch my other hair video. I'm going to have a link 
somewhere around this screen where I go into details on like how I do it, what I use, um, cause I mix it with, go watch the video. Mm -hmm. And there you have it. This was so fun to do. Like, I love this hair so much. You can put it in a ponytail. Like, it's just so flowing. Like, you don't have to worry about the wind blowing your hair away or nothing. Okay? Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to subscribe. Mwah.